Hi, and welcome back to my journey. I know it's been a little while. I've just been kind of taking care of myself. Um, haven't felt up to making a video. <clears throat> Still don't really have a voice, so... But I wanted to give a... Just like an update. Um, for... Actually, we just came through the Thanksgiving holiday for here in the States, and wish everybody a, a belated happy Thanksgiving. Obviously, Christmas is coming. Um, we got our tree up. And... Uh, as far as where I'm at, at my taper, I'm still tapering. I have switched to compounding pharmacy, so I'm doing a liquid titration, but it's with a syringe. Um, I think I'm at 13.2. I'll put that in the description. Um, so I'm still going. Uh, I'm a little behind where I was because this, the math, the way it worked out with the uh, compounding pharmacy is a little different, so it's a little slower by a few days. Um, which was okay because I um, needed to slow down a little bit anyway. Um, but it makes it much easier. So I will do a short little video on that because I think people would be interested because at this point now I've done dry tapering, I've done liquid, and now I'm doing the compounding. And this is by far the easiest, although I do have to pay for it out of pocket. Um, but I finally got low enough that I could do it. Um, and it's making life seem a little simpler to me. I wanted to also say RIP to Heather Ashton. Um, I know she passed away on September 15th of this year. Um, and I also wanted to, and I will leave a link in the description, There's a, there was a benzodiazepine awareness, I think it was a symposium, that was put on in, uh, I believe, Arizona. And I'd like everybody, I know it's like three hours long and I watched it in pieces, but there was one part two things. One, the gentleman who was leading the whole thing is a pharmacologist and his exact words are, after two weeks we have no idea what's going on in the human body. So that's a start. We just need somebody to say, I don't know. Not always telling us what they learned. Second was they did body scans of where the benzodiazepines attach in the body and they were expecting the head to light up and the whole body lit up which also explains, even in his words, the uh, symptoms that a lot of us are having. Um, they believe it binds directly to the mitochondria, which is fascinating to me because that's one of the things that I'm struggling with, and I know most of you are, is any energy at all, even to do this video or even sit up straight anymore. Um, but. That's promising because it gives me something to look for now. Look, at, you know, whether it's in holistic or whatever, probably holistic. But I know like PEMF is very good for that. Anyway, that'll probably be another video as well. I really just did this to one wish everybody a happy holidays. I'm planning on making a few more videos before the holidays and the new year. Um, but just saying that I'm here. Uh, and first of all, thank you to everyone who's reached out, whether it's by email. Um, comment on the YouTube channel. Some of us talk every once in a while through Facebook Messenger. Um, and again, I'd be happy to do that with anybody. Had people have asked me and then I've offered and then they kind of disappear. I, it's not, doesn't bother me. If I don't do it, it's because I'm not feeling well enough. But I'll, you know, I'll happily do it. Um, I think that's the other reason I did, I've, I've kind of held back from YouTube for a little bit was because I kind of felt like I needed to be this, I needed to be right with everything I told people. And I'm not. I'm going through this just like you guys are. So that said, I'm just here to, again. I need to get back to where I started this, and that was for myself, and to help just that one person out there that maybe once in a while will come along, that maybe I'll help, or they'll see one of these videos and be inspired to keep going, um, or inspired just to learn what they've been going through. Like for myself, it's 30 plus years, and it was only about four or five years ago that I realized, oh shit, it's the medication that's doing this, not the gaslighted um, definition that I've been getting from my doctors that it was just my label popping back up. Um, anyway, with that said, I will see you all very soon. <laughs> I said that last time, and I think it's been three months. But I love you all. Um, I know the holiday times are a tough time, but reach out. There's tons of us out there on the internet now, which is the other thing I'm so grateful for. I see so many new uh, 
videos coming up all the time, new people creating content, and it doesn't matter whether it's YouTube, that's kind of where I gravitate to. Um, but just thank you to everybody for spreading your, your truth, your story, your journey, um, and giving the rest of us hope. And uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.